At Volkswagen, their best-selling car is called the Golf. At Skoda, it's the Octavia. No wonder both are based on the same platform. Beneath the 2009 version of the Octavia 2, there's even the old Golf 5. Still, the facelift entails many new things. It's about time, too, because the current Octavia model has already been on the market for years now. The model treatment means more than just changes in details. The engine lineup was expanded to include a fuel-saving 1.4-liter gasoline version with 122 horsepower. It uses 6.6 .6 liters of fuel to cover 100 kilometers. As for lights and multimedia equipment, the new Octavia boasts various technical highlights. In addition, the face of the new Czech car has been restyled. Narrower fenders and a new grill with a chrome frame give the front section a more dynamic look. For the first time, the fog lights serve as turn indicators and daytime running lights on the Octavia, and they come standard. The exterior mirrors can be heated, adjusted, and fold in all electrically, and even have side indicators integrated into them. The rear is still typical of the Czech brand. The C-shaped taillights are unmistakably Skoda both day and night. On the inside, upscale materials and controls give you an ambience of quality. The seats in the Octavia are now in a new design and offer the comfort of a touring sedan. There's also some new multimedia equipment in the new Octavia. The new audio and navigation systems now have a color touch screen. On request, behind the glove compartment lid, there's even a hookup for an iPod and MP3 player. Buyers have the choice between 11 engines, 4 trim lines, a station wagon and sedan, the sporty RS variant, or the off-roader, the Scout. Pricing goes from 15,290 to just under 33,000 euros.